remember asking questions, we'll address you as nominee, and that's what you are before us. So we'll start in earnest uh, by asking you to tell us your name, your educational background, your work experience, and your key competences that make you suitable for appointment as cabinet secretary. You have under five minutes to do that. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. First and foremost, it is indeed a great honor to be in this house. Mr. Speaker, even though I must, I must confess that I, I was used so much being on the other side when I was a member of parliament with you in the 10th parliament. But Mr. Speaker, I want to begin by thanking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the favor upon me. And also thank His Excellency the President, <coughs> Dr. William Ruto, for nominating me for the position of Cabinet Secretary, Mining, Blue Economy, and Maritime Affairs. Mr. Speaker, my name is Hassan Ali Joho. I was born and raised in Mombasa. I went uh, to Tomboya Primary School in Mombasa, and later Serani Secondary School in Mombasa. So Mr. Speaker, I have a bit of a, a different approach on how I want to present my introduction because I started work and then education came, further education came later. So after I finished secondary school, I ventured into business, entrepreneurship. I set up a clearing and forwarding company in Mombasa, then later diversified to opportunities in fintech, a bit of real estate, and uh, largely logistics. Mr. Speaker, that takes about up to 2004, where I started uh, my grassroots engagement. I ran in a by-election that was not, not very successful, but taught me many lessons. I became the chairman of uh, LDP in Kisauni constituency. Then in 2006, I embarked on a journey to acquire my first degree. So in 2006, I did uh, a bridging course to enable me to join university teachings. I did a diploma in 2007 and eventually graduated from Kampala University in 2013. Thereafter, Mr. Speaker, I did another degree from Gretzer University. And then I enrolled myself Grace University is in Thika, mm -hmm. in Kiambu County. Thereafter, I enrolled in Harvard Kennedy School of Government for a program known as leadership, Public Leadership Credentials, which is basically a pathway to attain mid-career master's uh, degree on public administration. Mr. Speaker, I am the pioneer governor of Mombasa. I got elected in 2013. But before that, I was a, a member of parliament for Kisauni, the 10th parliament, where I served in different committees. Um, I served in the Committee of Foreign Relations, Defense and Foreign Relations, which I was a vice chairman, and several others. Uh, I served as an assistant minister, minister for transport um, uh, during the Kibaki administration. I was governor for one term and another. So I served my two terms as governor of Mombasa, where I must say I drew a lot of experience uh, in matters governance and uh, transformational ways of doing business in government, Mr. Speaker, and uh, the record speaks for itself of what I've, 
I was able to achieve in Mombasa. Uh, in matters health, in matters basic infrastructure, in matters early, early childhood, and uh, obviously lots of uh, social programs that would cushion vulnerable families uh, from uh, the day-to-day -day challenges of our lives. I thank you, Mr. Speaker.